March 8th every year marks International Women's Day globally. Women are recognized and celebrated for their achievements in their careers. In the military, it's more integrated along gender lines than in the past. Uganda People's Defense Forces has always recognized the key contribution which women make in the Army. Major Dukas Ayupo is an aircraft maintenance engineer, a department in UPDF which deals with warfare aircraft with its base at Entebbe. I, I was recruited in 1999. Those are very many years ago. And I joined and um, went for basic military, basic infantry. They call it basic infantry, which I did for one year. From there, mm -hmm. I came to Air Force. I joined as an A6 lever from A6 Direct, doing sciences, PEM. So when I joined Air Force, after aptitude, there is what we call aptitude where they they select who will fly, who will maintain. And if it is maintenance, which kind of maintenance will you do? So it so happened that um, I qualified to be an electrical engineer from, from, from the aptitude test. So I was taken for electrical engineering. That one I did it first in, um, in Israel. That was in 2011. Ayupo says that during her training, she even beat some men during military drills. And uh, my first aircraft I worked on was, was a MiG-21, which is also a fighter jet. Then from there, I went to Libya. I started uh, another kind of jet called MiG-23 with L-39. All those are jet aircrafts. From there, I advanced to this one. This is a very sophisticated one, which is a Sukhoi wish training we did in Russia. We first did the training in Russia for four months, theory. Then we came back here and continued with training for three years. Major Ayupo and her female crew work on a Sukhoi 30 MK2 fighter aircraft, a fourth generation aircraft, which is expensive and highly electronic. I did my OJT on all aircrafts. Then after, I, I was deployed in a Sukhoi. Enter the army, come join us, we shall be very happy to welcome you and we shall be very grateful to train you guys. Please come. I really urge you to join the army because in army we've been able to reach where we never expected actually. Um, very many people would yearn to be part of me but they don't have that chance. Major Dukas Ayupo, a mother of three, has served the Air Force with passion and diligently for over 20 years. I qualified to become the head of department. First, that's how I, I went in, in, in ranks, in the maintenance ranks. I became a head of department of communication and navigation. Mm, after some years, I became the acting squadron engineer of the squadron. And from there, uh, I went to the headquarter. She's privileged to be serving the Air Force, which in the past used to be for men before the trend changed thanks to her likes the message to the young ladies out there on women's day is that even even as the ladies you can make it you know aviation in general is male dominated then when you come to the military military is also male dominated but if you can see you can see this group of people i have this is just a sample of the many hmm? that shows that it's doable and possible. These are the stories of some of the UPDF Air Force women from the start of their careers, pushing themselves to the limit to achieve extraordinary things. I joined the Army in 2010, came to Air Force 2011. I've been in this specialty for the last 12 years on Sukhoi. And now my message to all ladies out there, I encourage them to do sciences. Let them join the military. It's a good place to be. You can still come here and be proud as a woman. Perhaps UPDF Air Force women are driven by the fact that they had more to lose than their male counterparts. This aircraft I specialize in department called communication and navigation. And in that department, just like the other word communication and navigation, uh, side of communication, you have to make sure that the aircraft carries two pilots. You have to make sure that the, before they leave for flight, the captain 
can communicate with a with a core. They say that there is an opportunity in the UPDF Air Force for the young girls, especially scientists, to join as professionals. The Russian Sukhoi 30 MK2 Mount Roll fighter aircraft is an improved version of the member of the Su 30 aircraft family, one of the aircraft acquired by the UPDF Air Force. Motesa Sira Haruna, UBC News. Happy Women's Day!